Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a battery charger from an old laptop charger. This is an old Acer laptop charger as you can see. It is uh, rated 19, 19 volt and 2.3 amps so in order to charge a, a battery you need to have a step down this battery right here as you can see this is a 12 volt battery it's a car battery I'm going to cut the wires from the laptop charger, strip it. Like this. And now you need to you need to know which which one of these two wires are positive and negative. I know which one is positive because this is the positive and this is the negative. But I'm going to check them. Anyway. I'm going to connect the laptop charger to the AC like this. And I'm going to check with my multi meter. See, it's 19.19 volt. It's, this is the positive and this is the negative side. Now I'm going to strip it a little shorter. Like this. And this is a step down converter that I bought on um, Aliexpress it can uh, step down I think around 30 to 40 to 5 to 5 to 30 volt I think so this uh, have a uh, output side I'm sorry for the yeah there output and this so there is input and this has uh, two variable potentiometer that you can uh, adjust the voltage and the amps so i'm going to first i'm going to disconnect this from i'm going to short it out because this have small capacitor that holds the charge no this one is this side is input i'm going to connect the positive side this of the laptop charger into this small step down converter like this if you have solder you can solder it it's better to solder because it will be mounted permanently Next, you need to have some clamps like this. This is already connected to a wire, and you need to find the negative output, which is the black one. Tighten like that, and the positive side. 
easy peasy and I think I have to lose this a little bit like that in zone and tighten it down there tighten nice and good and now I'm going to I'm going to connect this to power as you can see this lighting up because uh, it's showing that there is power in to the board and now we need to have a voltmeter in order to adjust the output voltage of the of this step down converter like this As I told you, you can adjust these potentiometers like, like there, there. I think I need a small screwdriver. This one is good. As you can see the voltage is going up, but I am going to have it around 14.19 or 1.2. That's perfect. This has a this has a two amp limits because if you have more than two amps it's not going to work. As you can see, when I short when I short these two wires, the light is going to Light is turning red. Now I'm going to show you the voltage of the battery. As you can see, it's 13.3 watt. I'm sorry, my camera is not focusing. See, 13.3. And when I connect this clamp to the negative and other one to the positive. there see the battery voltage is 13.16 and i can get the charger it's going up see it's charging until the voltage is 14.2 and when the voltage reaches 14.2 this uh, no it's almost fully charged because when it's charging, this light is turning red, and this light is turning red too. But when it is when it's fully charged like this, you see. This is. I'm sorry. When the battery is charging, both lights turns red. When the battery is full, this light here turns off, as you can see, because the voltage this battery is already fully charged. That's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe.